Good, good evening, everyone. <coughs> My name is Heath Haskins, Code Priming, and welcome to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video where we are once again searching for spookwood. I am flying through tonight, and I'm going to find some. I, I'm got to find some. This is like the th third server that I've been in so far. Uh, a lot of people have been asking me to do a collaboration, and I want to find spookwood. That's my goal. I need to find it. It's kind of like getting that battle royale um, in, in at least one of the seasons. You know, you got to get at least one. And this one's, the, it's, it's that important to me. It's like, if I don't get one, I didn't get the umbrella. <coughs> Anyhow. Um, very long day today. I mean, I was, I was working and doing code and programming and all kinds of stuff, and I realized I have an amazing job. <laughs> I have an amazing boss. I work for an amazing company, and it's, that's awesome. Uh, a lot of people still think that I do YouTube full-time, but this is, this is my job. This is not my job. Uh, this is my passion. This is my fun. This is my relaxation, my downtime. So I'm glad that I actually made fun out of it, made, made a, a thing out of it. I'm glad that you guys enjoy it. So, oh, okay, we're not going to be able to see anything, are we? It's just too foggy. Going to have to wait until morning time. Morning time. Okay, I'll, that's fine. I'll zip over here. We'll uh, we'll go look in the swamp and backsides here. Woo! Somebody said, hey, Code, if you let go of the, the, the button, if you stop driving when you're going down the, the hill and just use uh, A, and, A and D to, to move around. I, I know. I know that little trick, but I don't want to go that fast. Oh, there was something I did want to do, though. Um, last time... Here. Okay, so last time uh, we were down here, I actually moved this a little bit just with the, the truck. So this time I'm going to really move it. Come on, come on, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on. There you go, buddy, there you go. Oh, no way. Did it actually do it correctly? <laughs> that is awesome. All right. <laughs> that is so cool. So, the bridge has, has a new, new glitch. Um, by using the car glitch to, to kind of turn it and, and push, if you fall down behind the, the bridge, you can knock it off with the, uh, the old blueprint glitch. That is awesome. I am so proud of myself right now. <laughs> new glitches. I'm, I love new glitches. If you know a glitch that you haven't seen me do or you think that you might know one or a secret place or something like that, leave that in a comment down below. And it might be showing up on a video. Now, for the most part, I should, at this point, know all the glitches. But if if you can find a way to move the rock above the pink wood, the pink area, that would be a cool glitch to know. And I'm not talking about exploits. I am not an exploiter. People who do exploit, that's totally on you, and you know what, it's its your business because if you're going to get banned, if you're doing something to get yourself banned, you can't complain to me later and be like, oh no, I got my account disabled and I can't do anything. I'm sorry, you were doing what you were not supposed to be doing, and you knew it at the time, because... It's not like a mod. It's not Minecraft modding. You are exploiting a game. 
you're injecting code that is not supposed to be there. That is not okay. <sighs> Sorry. Now that I've gotten on to everybody. <laughs> At the same time, if you are an exploiter, it doesn't mean I don't like you. Alright? It does not mean that I don't appreciate you as a human being, because you're still human. And there's... there's... <sighs> I don't want you to feel bad about yourself, but I would like you to hear what I'm saying to you. You know, take into consideration that you make a lot of people mad when you exploit, and we don't. So, but code, I only do it for good. Don't care. But code, I help people out. Don't care. But code, I I don't like it when the the people do the the bad stuff. If you're using an exploit for good or for bad purposes. It is the exact same thing as being one of the bad people in my mind. There is no there is no level of right or wrong. It's a very it's there's no gray area with me. If you use an external program to inject code into this game that I love, that I've been playing for 6 years, then yes. You were doing something that I asked you multiple times not to do and I don't approve of. But I'm also not going to get on to you. Because it's your account to get banned. And you keep using it, you will get banned. A lot of people just learn harder. Learn the hard way. Okay, I'm going to call it. I don't, I don't see anything in this server. So, let's jump. Alright, I'm going to pause. Why is every server that I've been jumping in now at nighttime? Like, this is... Well, it'll give us a chance to search again. It's okay. By the dawn's early light, <clears throat> I found the spook tree. Oh, I hate to say this. I am tired today. It was just a very long day. Now, don't get me wrong. I don't exhilarate or exert myself as much as I used to whenever I was a correctional officer or a Marine. But I still get mentally exhausted. I mean, it's just, it really is, it is a mental exhaustion doing the code that I do. It's fun. Absolutely fun. What were we talking about before? Before the pause. There was something else. I was talking about exploits, right? Exploits. Exploits, exploits, exploits. Don't exploit. Blah, blah, blah. Done. Okay. Let's go look for some spookwood. The cherry trees always like freak me out. I'm like, ah, oh, that's a that's a spook tree. Come on, spook tree. Okay, nothing in this main biome area that I can see. I wish there were a faster car. I said this the other day, didn't I? Oh! Oh, 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 oh. Before I forget, big, big announcement. Projute is getting a facelift. Uh, Defaultio will be getting rid of World Point Nine on November first okay so on November 1st it is done there will be no more uh, no more point nine world everything's new he has updates to do server updates as well and when he does them that means everyone's going to reset you're gonna lose your property you're gonna lose your land your inventory nothing saves even Kip is going away and that's because it, it is not backwards compatible with the new stuff that he's putting in. By the way, I did see the tweet today of somebody finding Spookwood on the snow in the winter biome. So Spookwood does grow in this main area down here. Which, I didn't know that. That's something new to me. 
I don't think I'd ever seen it. Uh, again, if you keep looking and searching and finding, and if you find uh, Spookwood, then please tweet at Code Primate on Twitter. Send me a pic. I would love to see it, and then I will like it, comment it, and then I will pass it on. I will retweet it to the world. <clears throat> <laughs> and if you're exploiting to find it, please be sure to hide your interface, or I will not retweet it. <laughs> Y'all know who I'm talking to. <laughs> well, I don't know. You, you probably don't, but it was funny. Uh, let's just say a picture was posted, and we're like, oh, cool. And... Yeah, I won't go into details. I, I, I can't. I can't do that. But at the same time, I'm like, really? Really? Oh, are you just... Somebody is actually, like, driving up her. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 oh. Whew. Awesome powers it here. The older generation might get what I just said about the awesome powers thing. Skills code. Got to mad skills code. <laughs> this guy's gonna be like, how did you do that? Shaboom! What's up, milk carton zero? Hi, <laughs> code, oh my god. I, I forgot that it was a, I, I had the chat turned off. Hi, milk. How are you? So as you can see, there's there's nothing up here at the top. Let's uh let's take a quick peek <clears throat> over this direction. I wonder if it can grow in that little cave down there where the lighthouse is. I don't think it should be able to, but you never know. You know? Code, where are you? <laughs> Whee! <laughs> a little preemptive wee. Wee. Boom. Oh, I cleared the top of the tree. <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, I love it. I love it so much. I love being able to do that. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm now stuck in the winter biome. Okay. Let's get um, our little glitch going. And let's go. Rotate. Whee. There we go. Whee. Oh, oh, oh. Can I just. Can I go right through there? Right through here? Excuse me. Excuse me. Ro rotate. Come on. Rotate. And rotate. <laughs> it's like, ah! He goes, whoa! <laughs> now we check this bottom area first, right? So, uh, all we have to do now is just go around to the top. We can go through the through the top here. <laughs> um, my screen, the door is flipping like crazy. Oh, the, yeah. It happens. I think there's a there's a glitch with the the server script and the uh, the other thing the the server script and the the door script. I can't word today. No wording. I can't word. No words, Stephen. 
Strike it from the video. Edit it all out. No words. If you can't, if I can't smart words today, then no words at all. At all. Ta-da. <clears throat> Speaking of which, um, if you guys didn't know, I play in the mud. The <laughs> I, didn't. I play a multi-user dungeon called GatewayMud.org. There's information about it inside my uh, my Discord, and you can always Google it, Gateway Mud. But uh, I just reached level 100. Oh my goodness! Oh my gosh! Excuse me! Excuse me! Excuse me! Come in through! Come in through! Come in through! Thank you! Thank you! So I got to level 100, and I'm now starting to explore around. I need to get um, I need to get enough exploration points and enough quest points. And I can I can do this thing called avataring, avatar. That's where my character will gain special abilities and stuff like that. For those of you that didn't know, I am a, a level 100 cleric, a priest of Siana. I can heal and raise the dead and turn the dead and do all kinds of cool stuff. But that's that's the character I play. Oh no, sir. Are you okay? Do you need assistance? Oh, no, he knows. <laughs> the moment you see that truck pop up, you're like, oh, I know what he's doing. Boom. Rotate. Rotate. Come on. Boom. There we go. Rotate. Turn. Turn. <laughs> he goes, oh, Code, you are a legend. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> that bridge is awesome. I am so gl That's twice now. That's twice. That's the video. That's what it that you know, I didn't think that was possible for some reason. I don't even know why didn't why didn't I try that like years ago? That is an amazing glitch. That's the video, okay? Thank you for watching this episode of How to Glitch the Door Bridge. Uh, well, welcome, everyone. I don't know. Ooh, ooh, that's good. Mm. So we got this sampler, right? Mm. We got this thing of sampler coffees from, like, Sam's Club. And um, one of them is Dark Magic. And I love it. It's bitter. But it's very... It is dark roast. It is nice and strong. I like it. like it a lot. I don't see any spook woods around. And it's all this time I've been driving through town. Don't ever see what a spook wood tree is. Um... Oh, we could do it in the style of um, Beach Boys. Some folks say I gotta look around in Lumberland before I put it down. Spookwood, don't you know you're the wood? Uh, you're the tree for me. If I could find you, then they all would see you're the one. <laughs> so be true to the spook now, just like you do, Sinister. Chopping wood is okay now. Let the uh, let the pixels fly. I don't know. I don't, I, I don't have a something to rhyme with that last part. So that's. That's no good. Oh, I'm gonna make these people mad. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just jump into the. Ew, this is going to be so, so mean. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Easy. I'm sorry. Ah. <laughs> what? <laughs> Come on, Easy. Let's go, buddy. Let's go. <laughs> oh. God, why did you drown me? Oh god, I'm so sorry. Oh, did you lose any axes? 
<laughs> Did you lose any axes? I hope you didn't have one. <laughs> I have no access in the chair. Whoo! <laughs> Love. Go to the next one. I'm gonna pause it. <laughs> oh wait, how long? Yeah, yeah, we got ten minutes. It's fine. I think that this may be a broken server, considering there's no trees. Hmm. There's some birch trees, but nothing else. Yeah, we're gonna go somewhere else. Okay, we're back in, and um, Easy is following me in, so drowning you didn't get rid of you, buddy. No. Oh. <laughs> thank you for being a huge fan, and thank you for following me all the time. And hello! Hey, you were asking for um, a collab, I think. What, what was the message? Hold on, there was a chat. Can we collab now? I would love to play with you and hang out. That's that's cool, but um, oh, did did you just build there? I was gonna build there. That's okay. I can build over here. That's fine. It's fine. You just took my spot. That's all. Hello, code. Hello. How are you? Oh, by the way, I've got, um, I've got the, like, a thing called serious scene. If I, if I fade it over, this is my serious face. This is, I, I go big like this when I need to say something, and I need to say something about this book right here. The Advanced Roblox Coding Book, written and created by Code Primate. Right there, the official Heath Haskins Code Primate book. You need this. If you want to develop, like, Roblox games, this is the book for you. If you've never done programming before, or if you need to uh, refresh, listen. If you're already advanced and you know how to create and, like new games and stuff, this might not be the book for you. All right. I know it says advanced Roblox coding, but that's what this does. It takes you from zero knowledge, like you've never programmed before, and it takes you all the way up to like you'll be able to create your own game and start monetizing and making money off of it. That's what this thing does. Okay, that's that is the point of this book. It's 256 pages, I think. 200. Yeah, 256, 54, 55, 56. 256 pages of just pure awesomeness. Uh, by the way, you might check out the first book. A little cross promotion right there. Build and create your own world. Um, by David. <sighs> Anyhow. I like that. I love that I wrote a book. I mean, it's very, it's very cool, and the the way that it all happened, and the way that <laughs> I wrote a book. The kid who went through high school with most mostly C's and B minuses, who got told that you're going to struggle most of your life. And you, you're probably, you're not going to exert yourself and, and go further. I became a YouTuber. Went to the Marine Corps. I got married. Had two kids. Went to college. Got two degrees. Made mostly A's. And I mean, A, A pluses. Whatever you want to call them. I was, I was top of my classes by the time I went there. I've been a correctional officer for nine years. Did a really good job inside there. And still to this day, I still have inmates who will come up and shake my hand and say, CEO Haskins, you, you were awesome in there, sir. I just wanted to say, everybody else, they were, they were kind of mean just because we were inmates and they were, they were officers. And I just, I like to think that even though you're in trouble and even though you're like I'm executing your sentence is what I'm doing is I'm I'm carrying out the judgment is what I'm doing I'm making sure that you stay safe I still feel like I made an impact on people's lives in the way that I spoke to them in the way that I treated them 
because you're still human beings. A lot of people, they take a look at a prisoner or an inmate and they think, oh, you're a piece of crap. You're, you're, you're not uh, supposed to be in society. You, you need, no, that's not true. In fact, for the most part, everybody who goes to jail is the same people that you see inside Walmart. These are the same people that you see inside schools. These are the same people that you see at the voting booth, at the, the county, uh, no, that's, at the fair, you know, out walking around, having fun with their kids. These are, these are moms and dads and, and grandpas and grandmas and parents and children brothers and sisters, aunts and uncles. They're human beings. They're you and me. You know? Some people just, they got a bad rap. They got into the wrong crowd. They, they made a bad choice. They made a bad decision. They were in the wrong place at the wrong time. And I think that's what people forget. Because you see it all the time. You see it where people are like, I'm not like this, blah, blah, blah. You're in jail. Um, you do have a warrant. You didn't show up for your court date. Yeah, that's what happens. I'm a good person. I'm sure. I'm sure. You just you got mixed up. You, you messed up. This is one time that you've messed up. You know? It doesn't reflect badly on your entirety. You as a human being, you know? It's... It does happen. We need to do, do a turn. Let's do a turn. Whoa, 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 Come on, come on. What is going on here? <laughs> He's like, um, <laughs> don't worry about it. It's, it's natural. It's exactly what I meant to happen. Oh, oh. Oh, is this going to be some skills? Is this going to be some skills? Hold on. Hold on. Watch this. Can't get the cab through, but we can absolutely slide. Because, um, okay. <laughs> he goes, yay! <laughs> Alright, I'll leave, I'll leave the, the blueprint out this time. We'll, we'll need it. Probably. Let's see if I can do some more skills and, and drive up that, that ramp thingy again. I mean, it's practice. It's a lot of practice. You can, you can get good at it, too. I really should be showing you guys like how to chop down trees and how to build your your base up and stuff like that. Those those are the type of tutorials that keep getting views years down the road. Spookwood only gets views during uh, during October, you know, when you guys are like searching for it, you're looking for clues on where to find it, what what to do, stuff like that. I could not tell you how many times I went and looked up Spookwood trees in in YouTube. Oh, is are you running ahead of me? Hi, Fishy sixty one. Hey, somebody was trying to contact you. Is I think it was is the Aqua Aquafish? I think it was Aquafish. No, Fishy sixty one. Hey, buddy. I thought you lost your account. Maybe you got it back. Or it's a hacker. Oh, is that a hacker? Did somebody steal your account. Are you, on a, are you on a different account now? I don't know. I'm not going to question it. I'm just going to say, Hi! <clears throat> Hi! I remember, um... My... My base that I used to live in. Back in the Marine Corps. Um... I was on Camp... Camp Hansen? Camp Butler? Okinawa, Japan. Anyhow, the um, the room number I was in was 
uh, two seventeen. So, oh gosh. So I would say ni ichinana ukurasai. Could I please have two seventeen to the uh, the taxi driver? He say hi hi, twenty dollar. Okay. So it was very expensive rides. Of course, I, I was going from like Camp Hansen to Camp Butler, so it was a good forty-five minute drive. So I guess I can't fault him too much. I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. I guess that first part is probably the hardest one. I would say. Get up there, buddy. Get up there, buddy. Ugh. Oh god, I have a thousand ping. That might be why I can't get up there. Actually, can we just look real quick? Like, do we... Do I have to... I guess I don't really have to go up there, do I? Can we walk up this? Cannot walk up that. Oh, oh no! <laughs> All right, here we go. No! Oh no! <laughs> no! All right. You know what? We didn't need to look on top of the mountain either. Anyway, that's fine. <laughs> Out of the truck. Uh, you know what? Whoa. That was not the way I meant to turn. Wait. Where am I? Oh. <gasps> Access. <gasps> no. Co, oh, did you die? Please tell us. I'll reset. No. <laughs> I didn't die. <laughs> Come on, okay. Um, I should probably go get those. But I don't want to. I can just purchase some more right now. I think that's what I'll do. Um. Oh. Oh. It is. It is time. So. I am going to jump. Jump out. I'm taking one last peek around. One last Pikachu. Pika Pika. Okay. Fine. Alright. 
Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below, do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good YouTuber does, but it's really your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. I love you guys very much. Have a great night. Um, I hope this was fun, because I'm, I'm getting really tired of not finding some spook wood. Hmm. Love you guys. <gasps> Outro. Want some new merch? Check out teespring.com. Outro.